So for my fitness leadership activity, um, I'm going to go through my warm-ups, my exercises, my cardiovascular exercises on days where I'm hitting chest and back. So for starters, um, I'll go over my warm-ups. Warm-ups I usually pretty much do pretty fast. Um, kind of just like get my muscles going. Um, don't really do a whole lot of warming up. Um, but I do when I do decide to do bench or any of my chest activities because I usually go pretty heavy. So... Usually warm up with about a three by five of regular grip push-ups and then wide push-ups. So go ahead and start those. Lucky for you, that's what I love. That's what I love. Lucky for you, that's what I love. That's what I love. Shake my life out of your fucking head. Stop shaking, stop and turn and turn to my head. Lucky for you, that's what I love. That's what I love. Lucky for you. that I kind of go into stretching my back out a little bit uh, I do experience a lot of tightness throughout the day with my back uh, depending on most lifts uh, I usually I usually always stretch out my back so most of the time I do a set of 10 each leg with the pretty much like a crossover from behind so I'll bring the leg up here and try to touch my other hand just like this, just to stretch it out a little bit, kind of like loosen my shoulders up a little bit. So, kind of warm everything up, get everything ready to go. And then we'll do a little bit of Lucky for you, that's what I love. That's what I love. You say you want a good time. First, here I am, baby. Here I am, baby. and everything like that just because when you pinch um, your glutes can kind of have an effect it kind of affects how your stance is and bench I mean I have a power lifter slash bodybuilder type stance for bench so it's a little different than normal how like a sport would actually teach it so I usually tend to just warm up everything kind of stretch out the groin area this kind of targets my glutes a little bit, not too much because I don't want to kind of, kind of still sore from legs yesterday, so I don't want to do too much. But that, that conducts my warm up for bench and so my other chest exercises I'll go through today. All right, for cardiovascular exercise after my chest warm-up and a little bit of my lower body warm-up I, I actually tend to do about 10 to 15 minutes on the treadmill running um, I don't want to do a lot because I really don't want to fatigue myself out before I start any of my other exercises um, kind of really do this just to get the blood moving and pretty much just get get a little bit of a sweat going um, I don't think it's much of a workout if you're not really sweating. Um, so I'll usually run on the treadmill at about, depending on how I'm feeling that day, anywhere from like five to eight miles per hour. Um, and I'll run probably for like, in reality, it's probably like five to 10 minutes because usually I can build up a sweat pretty easily. Uh, feel pretty energized and ready to go. Um, so. I'm not gonna film my whole time on here, um, but I'll usually build up. I'll probably, I'll do it like a couple, probably like 20 or 30 seconds of just running on the treadmill just to get myself going. So. Now 
Now tell me who's the fairest? Is it you? Is it you? Is it me? Is it me? You say it's us, and I'll agree, baby. Jump in the Cadillac, girl. Let's put some miles on it. Anything you want, just to put. So pretty much be just like that. Just at a constant pace for about, like I said, anywhere from five to fifteen minutes, just depending on how I'm feeling the day and depending on what I hit. Um, so I'll probably end up in about 10 minutes of this and then getting into my exercise. Lucky for you, that's what I like. That's what I like. Set by the fire at night. Sound sheets and diamonds all white. Lucky for you, that's what I like. That's what I like. Lucky for you, that's what I like. That's what I like. I got a condo in Manhattan Baby girl, what's happening? You and your ass invited So go and get to clapping So pop a phone, pop, pop, pop it for me Run around and drop it for a plan drop, drop it for me I went to beach house in Miami Wake up with no jammies Off the tail for dinner Julio served that scampi You got it if you want it got, got it if you want it Said you got it if you want it Take my wallet if you want it now Jump in the Cadillac Girl, let's put some miles on it Anything you want Just to put a smile on it You deserve it, baby You deserve it all And I'm gonna give it to you Gold jewelry shining so bright Strawberry champagne on us Lucky for you, that's what I like That's what I like Lucky for you, that's what I like That's what I like Set by the fire Exercises. I'm gonna do a post recovery. Usually, I don't usually stretch after my workouts. Probably should. Um, I do a lot of BCAAs, so I'll probably go home and make a BCA um, drink mix. But since I did chest and a little bit of uh, well, chest and back today, I'm gonna do some arm swings front and back. And I'm also gonna do some wall stretches with the with the wall, of course, uh, to stretch out my uh, shoulders and stuff. Uh, you know, having shoulder surgery, kind of, you feel a little bit of everything throughout your back and your chest. So I'm gonna do a little bit of that too. And it's so bright, strawberry champagne on us. Lucky for you, that's what I like. That's what I like. Lucky for you, that's what I like. That's what I like. Stretch by the fire. tension like I do today um, I actually don't have with me bikes you take a lacrosse ball put it on the wall and roll out the muscles and tendons that are um, in distress but for the most part that's gonna be most of the post workout stuff I do um, I'm gonna go home and drink protein shake and drink BCAAs as well help with recovery just help put a little bit more carbs calories and protein back into my system that I just lost so that conducts my 
leadership activity.